Are you looking to get a waffle maker? Maybe even this frozen one that makes snowflakes? If so, then you're on the right video because today I'm gonna share with you more about waffle makers and this one. Aloha everyone and welcome to today's video, a waffle maker review, this frozen snowflake waffle one and more. My name is Iceland and on this channel, Boylan's Happily Ever After, we share family videos, mommy videos, and have product reviews from time to time like this one. So if you're new and this interests you, please consider subscribing. And if you want to know more about anything you see here on this channel, be sure and check the links down in the description below this video or leave a comment. I'd love to connect with you there. And as always, if you think these videos on this channel may help someone, please share them where you can. Now, let's get into waffle makers and this one. Well, the winter season and holiday season is just around the corner, what better way to do it than this waffle maker and bringing a touch of that fill into your home with some snowflake shaped waffles. So a quick little backstory here, we were wanting a waffle maker, I have been wanting to get a Mickey Mouse one from like my childhood forever, and I just held off before we left Oregon and knew I would get one when we moved here to Hawaii, not ship the one that we had there. And I can't tell you how many waffle maker options there are online and we finally decided on this snowflake one. We've had this one for almost two years now. If you've been watching our channel, then you may have seen them mentioned and watched us make them before. And you can tell this one is a little well-loved. Unfortunately, on the side, it has turned a little yellow, but that's okay. It does have the cutest little believe in the journey and picture on the front with Anna, Elsa, Olaf, Sven, and Kristoff. And then I'll show you inside the plates here really quick. It has this little snap part here for when it shuts. The light, which is blue, which I think is really cool for when it's cooking and lets you know that it's done cooking. They really do look like a snowflake waffle. And Micah and I were talking about how we believe this is some of the favorite waffles we've had because the depths of the plate actually make them pretty thick and fluffy so you, even though they're smaller than I envisioned them being they still are a good sized waffle and just so tasty they are non-stick ba baking plates however after a while it does get a little sticky so we just use a little spray on them and we're good to go again inside here is the instruction manual you can take a look at all that safety and guidelines and stuff how to use it instructions cleaning and storage some waffle baking hints and suggestions, your one year warranty, and then I thought this was really neat. It offered some recipes on how to make buttermilk waffles, cinnamon waffles, chocolate waffles, and pumpkin waffles. Here it is a little closer. Again, I'll be sure and link this down in the description below for you. You can go and check out more there. It's definitely been used and well loved. And we've just been so happy with it and using it a lot. There is also an Olaf waffle maker. So if you wanted to get like Mickey mini or go with a theme of waffle makers and have more than one, that is a fun idea. We are really limited on space here. And so the minimal amount of stuff works best for us. If I had my choice, I'd probably have 10 different types of waffle makers. So I'll also link some of my favorite ones down below for you to check out as well too. I think my favorite part to do with waffles is to add a little bit of berries in them. It does take them a little longer to cook and more steam comes out, which is probably why we've started to see some of this on our waffle maker. I question if we hadn't put berries in them, if it would have even done this to the waffle maker. And then I love to just dust a little bit of powdered sugar over the waffles. It looks so nice and it helps give it a little bit of the winter snow vibes with that. It is made by Disney. If you know us, we are big Disney fans on this channel. Also, Black Friday's around. You might find some good deals on waffle makers. You never know. This also just makes a great gift idea. Maybe you even have a huge Frozen fan, family member, or friend. You could surprise them with this cute little waffle maker. We did basically start almost all over here when we moved to the islands and got new products. This by far has been one of my favorite purchases we have made here. Especially since it's tropical and warm here and we do love winter as well. And so just having a snowflake waffle maker puts a smile on your face. You can put Frozen on the TV and enjoy. And of course, having my other channel, Snowflake Forest Felting. I mean, I'd have to own a snowflake waffle. 
waffle maker if that was an option, right? <laughs> if you haven't checked that channel out, you should. I've been working really hard on it along with a couple of our other channels. All that stuff's linked below for you. I just can't say enough good things about this waffle maker and suggest it as a gift idea or for yourself if you're looking for something fun for your kitchen. That's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new, enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, share these videos where you can. We'll see you in the next one. Mahalo!